like to call the meeting, the district of Chatwin to order. With, uh, start with the opening statement. Any new items? See, we have one uh, late item for the agenda. Uh, C3, uh, response to the premiers uh, for the leadership table. Has everybody received the late item? Is there anything else that needs to be uh, added? Kate, not seeing it. Any adoption of the agenda? So moved. Second. Okay, favor, carried. Okay, all those in, <clears throat> we've got minutes of the regular meeting on October 7th. Motion to receive. Second. Favor, carried. Minutes of the public hearing on October 7, 2019. Second. Carried. I'm, all those in favor? Carried. And I see we don't have any, any delegations. And uh, we've got a mayor's report. Uh, can I just uh, have... Oh, okay. One item prior to the bylaws, when we go to the mayor's report, I should have brought this up at the beginning. Could we have that at the end here, where prior to adjournment? Uh, can I can I do that, Carol? Move your mayor. Yes. Sure. Okay. Thank you. Okay. We will continue with the. Uh, Discussion items? Where are we? Okay, we're number five. We're at the District of uh, Chetwin, the District of Chetwin Bylaws, uh, District of Chetwin Cemetery Amendment Bylaw number 1102 2019. Second. Second. All those in favor? Good, Gary. B2, District of Chetwin Tax ex Exemption Bylaw, number 1103-2019. Second. Thank you. Those in favor? Gary. Okay, uh, C. CR3 has been moved, CR4, administra Administrator's Report. Motion to accept. Second. Second. Carried. Okay, discussion items. Email from BC Council of Forest Industries, Kofi, October 19th Convention. I would make that recommendation that council authorize the mayor or all <coughs> to attend the Council of Forest Industries Convention in French Door, April 1st through the 3rd, 2020. Second. All those in favor? Carry. DI2. E Email from the Minerals North Conference Association dated October 10th, 2019, re-2020 Minerals North Conference. I'll motion that council authorize the mayor or alternate to attend the Minerals North Conference in Quinnell, BC, April 29th through May 1st, 2020. Okay, any discussion? All those in favor? Carried. DI3, 
2019 Wood Solution Conference information. I'll make that motion that Council authorize the Mayor Alternate to attend the Wood Solutions Conference in Vancouver, BC, November 5th, 2019. Second, any second? Second. Okay, uh, discussion? I uh, pulled this one out. Uh, I was uh, interested in this. Uh, when, I, when I met at uh, UBCM with the forest industry, I found that they were uh, possibly moving in the direction of uh, uh, having wood products other than dimensional lumber. So this is a uh, kind of interested me and uh, we might, we have two uh, sawmills in our uh, mist here that are, are kind of uh, in a crunch with our uh, commerce. Uh, so I believe that they might be going in this direction and if we're aware of what's going on out there and uh, what we can do as a, as, as a community and council and mayor, we should be up to date on stuff like this. So this is why I pull this out. Any more discussion on this? All those in favor? Okay, carry it. Okay, then the late item, C3. Uh, response to the Premier for the le uh, leadership table. Don Wright, uh, the minister handling the, the leadership table, uh, re caribou issue that we've been ha having, they sent me a letter as uh, mayor of Chatwin to uh, the letter reads, thank you for your invitation dated uh, September 30th, 2019 to participate in a leader's table on a date yet to be determined regarding the draft intergovernmental partnership agreement for the conservation of the central group of South Southern Mountain Caribou. This issue is of great concern to the district of Chatwin and the other and other residents, businesses and elected officials in the Peace Region. Uh, you may be aware that the Peace River Regional District (PRRD) is the local government uh, government authority with uh, jurisdiction over the land surrounding the district of Chatwin and has been at advocating for Chetwin with respect to the caribou issue. The district of Chetwin is disappointed and disappointed that PRRD board chair or vice chair uh, were not invited to participate in the leadership table. With that in mind, and especially in, the, in view of the regional impact and the draft and the draft uh, of the Interprovincial Partnership Agreement for the Conservation of Central Mountain, Central, Central Group of Southern Mountain Caribou could have uh, Chetwin Mayor and Council therefore respective, respectfully decline your invitation to attend a leadership table unless Chair or Vice Chair from the PRD Board are also invited to participate. Thank you and Please contact me should you have any questions or concerns regarding the above. A uh, little bit of background on, uh, on us sending this letter. They invited us to a meeting on October the 17th, the four mayors from uh, Tumbler Ridge, Dawson Creek, Fort St. John, and Chatwin. They did not include the Peace River Regional uh, Chair or Vice Chair. So we were, uh, in our response, we were uh, disappointed that's uh, contained in our letter that uh, they weren't involved because this is their uh, uh, region that uh, uh, Dan Rose uh, is a director. So anyway, with uh, with that, this letter is uh, being sent to uh, to the premier and to uh, Don Wright. Yep. Question. Um, in the letter, you say that the PRRD is board chair or vice chair. Can you please explain what that is? Yes, he is vice chair. Oh, is he vice chair? Yes. Okay, because he's kind of the one that he is leading the yes. top, right? Not the chair or the guard or nothing. Uh, like that's um, Brad. Brad. Brad, like Brad, Brad Sterling. Like no, no, it would be Dan. And uh, according to uh, what we've been talking about at the PRD, that uh, 
we would send Dan because he's uh, he's the most uh, knowledgeable on this uh, caribou issue. So, or alternate, right? Uh, be the chair or alternate. So that's where they'd go, and it would be Dan. We wouldn't want to send any anybody else other than uh, yeah, Dan Rose. Yeah. Chair, so the yeah. Chair we we need yeah. yes we need we need to get them on uh, at the table. Okay. Anywhere? No. I I have no control over uh, what uh, other people send letters, but we do have control of what we do. So if uh, they do that, that's great. Uh, right now, after the invitation was given to us, they've uh, since uh, declined uh, to. Uh, we had a meeting on the 17th, and they've uh, postponed that. So Blair Lexram uh, got got a hold of the premier's office and says, why weren't they invited? And uh, so this is where our letter stands to back that part of our uh, uh, other mayors. That's that's their business, what they, they would well, participate. <laughs> Yeah, in in the in the PRD, one one said he was going, but then they canceled the meeting on the seventeenth. So it, it's in the PRD. Uh, if anybody wants to watch it, it's it's all there. So there was only one mayor that said, "Oh yes, I'm going." The other three said, "No, we we back the PRD in this case." Any more? Good. Okay. All right, carry on. Information? Did you want to get a mover and a second mover to receive? Oh, right, right. Let's, uh, we need a motion for the, to receive all the correspondence. Motion to receive 515. Okay. Second. Okay, thank you. <coughs> Information? Is that I-1 uh, through I-3? Second. Okay, carried. All right, back to the mayor's report. Okay, uh, I had a little report here, and uh, and I'd like to go to the bottom paragraph, and uh, I would like to thank uh, the media for coming out, and uh, and supporting us when we we need support. So that means the coffee talk and uh, chat radio and uh, TV for all their uh, support, supporting council in whatever fashion they do, and uh, it was. It is a good relationship, and I guess we are uh, uh, moving forward with uh, Linda leaving us for better uh, territory or worse, maybe. <laughs> but uh, thank you for uh, your attendance to uh, uh, to the council and to the mayor, and it was uh, quite quite good of you to come here and not say too many bad words about us. <laughs> yeah, just a thank you. Uh, so I'm going to read this. Uh, today I would like to uh, take the time to thank the residents and the media for our fine community for the support they showed to the council and especially to the mayor's office. Without you, we don't have the opportunity to attend functions that are important to Chetwin and mayor. And as a longtime resident, I have a better understanding of what it takes. One year and one day, October 20th, 2018 to October 21st, 2019. Uh, this was a good year. And I had a quote from uh, Dwight Eisenhower. A sense of humor is part of the art of uh, leadership, of getting along with people and getting things done. Thank you. And do uh, I need adjournment? Motion to adjourn. Second. Thank you. Adjourn.
most important thing for us is for kids to feel excited about science, to feel like it's accessible, it's fun and it's exciting, and that it's not something that you only do in the science lab once a week with one specific teacher. It's something that you do in everyday life with objects around you, uh, and it's something that is fun and inclusive and exciting and, and brings joy. And we'll go up further is 
just up the hill here is where my grandma Marceline lived, where I lived and was raised. I'm trying to figure out today, I think we moved here in 1960. Everybody, we squatted up here. We, nobody owned their properties. My grandma, for extra dollars, she used to make hides every day. It, all my life I could remember her making hides. As you can see on the one video, um, this is what she did for extra dollars. From Ontario West, yes. Oh, it's amazing. Um, I guess television movies now. Oh my goodness, it was on the backs of paper bags, it was on scrap pieces of paper, this and that. So uh, I typed it up, uh, edited it, sent it to publishers, and the, they turned it down saying, there is more, there is more. What happened after the dam was built?
Thank <laughs> you. 